Chad, if you're over 35 and aren't married or don't have a girlfriend or somehow have not been in a relationship for the past like five years or something like that, you might as well already come out as a transgender already. We already know you want to transition to a female. Just please fucking admit it and just be, be yourself and be happy, please. Stop acting like you fucking like women, okay? We know you want to fucking dress up as a female. Who gives a fuck, man? Just be happy. Please, accept it. Nothing wrong with that, dude. Seriously. Nothing wrong with wanting to be a fucking female. But just stop acting like you're some kind of fucking macho man, though, walking around, you know, acting like... That's the thing, though. Sometimes people who, before they transition into a female, they have, like, this persona or ego where they think they're, like, some kind of fucking masculine man or something. They're dominant or everybody want to give advice and shit. And, oh, I taught him a lesson in life. He should have listened to me. It's like, just fucking be a female. We know you want to wear a wig and wear a dress, bro. We don't give a fuck. If you want to give somebody advice, go fucking have children. Go be an asshole to your fucking child, not to another grown man, or else you're going to get your ass fucking beat. That's what's going to happen eventually. Go tell your children not to chase their dreams. Don't tell another grown man not to chase their dreams. Go tell that to your children. If you want your children to play the safe route in life, if you don't ever want to take any risk, if you don't want them to chase their dreams, play the safe route, go to college, son, do all this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I know how to be a man. I'll teach you how to be a man. I, I know how to be a man. Yeah. Save that for your own kids, not for other grown-ass men, because they're just going to tell you to fuck off, and nobody gives a fuck about your own opinion, bro. Nobody gives a fuck about your opinion, bro, for real. Nobody cares. Nobody cares what you got going on. Everybody's focused on getting rich themselves, bro. Nobody has time. Nobody has time. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for this. Yeah, we don't either, dumbass. What the fuck do you think you are? It's just you whose fucking time is valuable? Fucking stupid, bro. Can't stand some people in life, man. Just hurry up. I don't have time for this. Just fucking hurry up and get this over with already. I wouldn't be fucking talking to you if I fucking didn't ha you know, if I, if I didn't want to waste my time. Fuck out of here, dude. Guess we're all going to Heian Tower, then. <laughs> You're not the only one with time on his hands, after all. Great, we're all unemployed. We have all the time in the world now to go fight. This the squad? Let's go to the strip club. Nah. They don't even have those in Japan, bro. They got massage parlors! We are back in the city. I've got some more fight in me. Who's taller? You got about an inch on me. Now let's compare dicks. Pull your pants down. Let me show. All right. It's been a while. Let's get something to eat, man. Let's go to a sit-down restaurant. Calling a cab by moving the cursor to a taxi icon. What? It's that much? Chinatown? What do you think, gang? Should we take him on? Let's do it. Okay. Okay, we're definitely fighting higher level enemies now. Dude, what was that, man? Woo! Ah! Who brings a knife to a fist fight, bro? It's not like we have a bunch of weapons! 
Attack! Let's do it. Ah, to think there'd come a day when we'd share a meal here. I'll say. Still, I assumed it'd just be us. Actually, they're here on Ebina's orders. <laughs> I made a lot of enemies before getting arrested. Plenty of people out there still hate my guts, it seems. Oh, I did what you asked. Got my passport right here. Ah, excellent. So, uh, what's this favor you're asking? I'm sending you to Hawaii. There's someone there who wants to meet you. Hawaii? Uh, who is it? Well, we're going to America? It's your mother. What? She's the one woman the boss truly loved. Akane-san. Huh? W wait, that's... Just so we're clear here. Yes, you are indeed the boss and Akane-san's child. That fateful day 40 years ago, I saw everything with my own eyes on that day. Two babies at the coin lockers were sadly... So this is how we go to Hawaii. He's going to give us unlimited money too over there probably. Man, this game is about to get crazy. No way. What? We're going to Hawaii? I'm not gonna lie. I'm not. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. The game is kind of moving slow at first, but I think it's about to get real fun. You were, of course, replaced with the son I abandoned. The son I abandoned. How did I know he was gonna say that? How did I know that? I think I can read minds now. You have every right. You know, I've always had two fathers: Jiro Kasuga at the Shangri-La Soapland. And by oath, Where am I at? Where am I? It's worth. That's all I needed. Where the fuck am I right now, dude? Maybe you're right. That said, what about your mother? Right. What about her, dude? Come on. Let's get to it. I want to go to Hawaii, bro. All right. So we're sending us to Hawaii for some reason. You see, the boss had heard Akane-san was caught by the Hikawa family. But he never saw her body for himself. He kept believing she was out there. And so he strung up one Hikawa member. But by then, it was too late. Contract? Professional bro and it Okay, I care about the story chat, but at the same time, it's like how fucking long can Japanese people talk for smoking cigarettes, dude? They're coming! Oh my god! Ah! 
He took on like 50 guys at once! Let's go! Wait a minute, bro might be Jake Gyllenhaal! No way, they're just... You dumbass! I guarantee you he pissed and shit himself in that half second he was alive for, dude. He was just standing there with a gun pointed at the door. Him. Plans already in motion. Give it up. As far as I call this bluff, you crossed the point of no return a long time ago. Did you forget? Where the fuck is a cutting? No longer in the country. She's bound for the Philippines. Stowed away in some shady looking cargo ship, it seems. Imagine a pretty little thing by her lonesome with hardly a yen to her name. Surely she has to earn her keep somehow. Oh my god, this guy's sick. I hear life at sea is quite demanding, but it's the men that see you I'd be concerned about. Oh, hell nah. <laughs> Bet you they're lined up as we speak. Shit. You piece of shit! Yes! Yes! Tell your men to stand down. No, come on, take it. Go! Do it! Each finger, come on! They'll be dead just like you! Hikawa! <laughs> That's the spirit. Our He's God. laughing! Put an end to the laughter! Start shooting off fingers! Where's the samurai sword at, bro? You could do so much with a samurai sword. Let's go. Make the call. Do it already. I would have already shot off at least three, four fingers just to start. And then after that, then you start doing that. You know what I'm saying? Like. One really has to wonder, though. How bad is your bitch holding up? Shoot his finger down there. Shoot his bigger finger. Make him set the make ah, make him set the barrel of the gun like a dick. Let's go. But no <laughs> the man kept on laughing till the bitter end. Okay, yeah, he is definitely a madman. That guy is fucking sick. He's just laughing, fucking saliva coming out the mouth and shit. Oh my god, that was crazy. You never found out. I would have just had fun with him at that point, dude. Seriously. Now he had no chance. That would have filled me with so much anger. You ever just want to fucking torture somebody? You know what I'm saying? Was headed for the mm, just really let out all the aggression you have built up for someone. Just, you know what I'm saying? He flew to the oh wait, I'm the only one. Oh, oh shit, my bad. He formed his own family. His subordinates joined the search, but nothing ever turned up, and the years just kept passing by. He came to believe that if. Chad, would you guys believe me if I told you I don't smoke or uh, drink alcohol at all? Completely sober right now. Would you guys think I'm just crazy or something? My son were alive. 
she would have contacted him. That day never came. So he and the rest of us assumed the worst. Though no one ever said it out loud. So what happened to that girl? Really? Is that really what happened to her? What that guy said? Because that's fucked up if it is, man. That's the only type of stuff that makes me want to act crazy like that and torture somebody is when, like, there's a female who's in harm. Or a child who's in harm. You know what I'm saying? Somebody who's innocent. That, that's really fucking crazy, bro. This is her? Akane-san? She's native Hawaiian. Why did he just nut? Albeit with some Japanese blood mixed in. Oh. I have that blood too? Guess that's how it goes. Ten years had passed since Akane's son went missing. Then, one day the boss got an emergency call. It was from an officer of a Filipino group we had. Chad, do you guys think that he shot off all his toes too after the fingers? In Hawaii, who looked just like her. Then that mean maybe she moved back home at some point. Yeah, we'd been looking at that angle too. But the so so it was what? Well, uh, and yeah, she ran. Huh? And I'm, I'm just gonna fucking skip through it because I'm actually fucking pissed right now at the fact that it's taking this long, dude. Why is it taking this long to get to the cutscene? There should not be this much storyline. When I saw Akane-san, I was planning to kill her. There should not be this much lore. Let us get to Hawaii and have some fucking fun, game. God damn, dude. <laughs> Even I couldn't help trembling. More storyline. Great. Every intention to get rid of the woman the boss loved. However... I ended up walking away. I'm sorry, but even Red Dead 2 has fucking less storyline than this, dude. There's more action in Red Dead Redemption 2 right now than this game. That's it. We're playing Red Dead 1 now. Let's just hop into Red Dead Redemption 1, bro. It shouldn't come as a surprise if you think about it. Now, if Kai Sinat wants to play Red Dead 2, I'm going to play Red Dead 1 then. Before he plays it. So I don't look like I'm following him, bro. I didn't follow him when it came to Red Dead 2 when I played it, because I played it three months ago. Oh, it doesn't matter! Who cares? From then on, it was her life. I'm gonna buy a whip off online and start whipping myself on the back with a chat. Just to pat so myself on the back. Her I gave word oh my the god, bro, this game. Come on, dude. I told him the Hikawa family had reached her first. That all I'd found was her lifeless body. Nothing more. The boss quietly accepted my report. The search for Akane-san was called off. Anyone and out there watching being like, why is he even fucking end. streaming if he's pissed right now? Like, if he doesn't enjoy streaming, why is he even streaming then? Just so that way he doesn't have to work a regular job and just be so he can make money by streaming. So he's just forcing himself to fucking do it. After that, I stayed in contact with her. Though sparsely, I needed some control. He's just hoping he somehow blows up magically so he doesn't have to fucking work a job again his entire fucking life. Still, Dude, no fucking way, there's still more. Anyhow, Fuck you guys, I'm gonna look up the story later. I'm not gonna watch all this, dude. Won't you see her, Ichi? So I gotta find this chick in Hawaii or what, bro? I beg you. You know, I never thought I'd see the day you bowed your head to me. All right, I'll go see her. Well, I would have killed you if you'd said no. Why would you admit that? That just made me lose all motivation. What's up? Hey, good to see you're still in one piece. Huh? You guys waiting for me? Nanba was worried about you, and I somehow missed my chance to skedaddle. Look who's talking. That's what I was about to say. So did you find out what 
Sawashiro's special request was? Mm. Yeah, about that. Things got a little complicated. You don't say, then. How about we head over to the yeah. Survive? Let's go to the bar, then. Hey. Hmm? Uh, let's go to the bar and drink, since we don't drink in real life anymore. Because if I do, I'm going to talk ten times more shit than I was just talking a second ago. Damn, courthouse? Bro, where are we going right now? Dude, I need a bike or something. Why the fuck are we running through- Why are we running through town, bro? We're grown-ass men. Where's our car at? None of us have a car. Three grown men, and none of us have a car, really. You're just gonna follow me around everywhere. You guys have nothing else to do. You're unemployed. Seriously? Bro, I need to get laid. I'm over here hanging out with two men. Chat, if you're over 35 and aren't married or don't have a girlfriend or... Somehow have not been in a relationship for the past like five years or something like that You might as well already come out as a transgender already We already know you want to transition to a female Just please fucking admit it and just be be yourself and be happy please Stop acting like you fucking like women okay We know you want to fucking dress up as a female Who gives a fuck man just be happy please accept it Nothing wrong with that dude seriously Nothing wrong with wanting to be a fucking female But just stop acting like you're some kind of fucking macho man though Walking around you know acting like That's the thing though sometimes people who before they transition into a female they have like this persona or ego where they think they're like some kind of fucking masculine man or something. They're dominant over everybody. Want to give advice and shit. And oh, I taught him a lesson in life. He should have listened to me. It's like just fucking be a female. You mean we know you want to wear a wig and wear a dress, bro? We don't give a fuck. If you want to give somebody advice, go fucking have children. Go be an asshole to your fucking child, not to another grown man, or else you're gonna get your ass fucking beat. That's what's gonna happen eventually. <laughs> Go tell your children not to chase their dreams. Don't tell another grown man not to chase their dreams. Go tell that to your children. If you want your children to play the safe route in life, if you don't ever want to take any risk, if you don't want them to chase their dreams, play the safe route, go to college, son, do all this shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I know how to be a man. I'll teach you how to be a man. I, I know how to be a man. Yeah. Save that for your own kids, not for other grown-ass men, because they're just going to tell you to fuck off, and nobody gives a fuck about your own opinion, bro. Nobody gives a fuck about your opinion, bro, for real. Nobody cares. Nobody cares what you got going on. Everybody's focused on getting rich themselves, bro. Nobody has time. Nobody has time. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for this. Yeah, we don't either, dumbass. What the fuck do you think you are? It's just you whose fucking time is valuable? Fucking stupid, bro. Can't stand some people in life, man. Just hurry up. I don't have time for this. Just fucking hurry up and get this over with already. I wouldn't be fucking talking to you if I fucking didn't have, you know, if I, if I didn't want to waste my time. Fuck out of here, dude. Some people are so fucking just... They just need to be humbled so bad, bro. Including me. Somebody come try and humble me, please. I wish. Let out some of this aggression on this game, bro. Please, man. Just come over here and start fucking punching me, please. 
I see. Okay. Especially, okay. I, I'm not reading all this shit, dude. Hey. Okay. Okay. Chat, you guys don't think I'm having fun playing the game right now, but I'm actually having a good time sure. right now. I'm actually happy right now. This is me in a good mood, I promise you. <laughs> oh my god, he's still- wait a minute. Chat, if you guys haven't watched the last stream yet, he's still left on red from the chick he tried to fucking propose to. The first date, he was on a date with a chick that he'd known his whole life. He wanted a date with a chick he knew his whole entire life. And on the first date, he proposed to her. He asked her to marry him. And now, she doesn't even respond to his texts, and he's in the friend zone. So, never propose to a girl on your first date. That's what's gonna happen. Hold on. Yeah. Hmm. Listen. Got it. Thanks. <coughs> 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 Finally, out of this damn apartment? Well, shall we? Now that I think about it, this is my first time visiting Arakawa's grave. Yeah, same yeah. for me. I haven't been in a while myself. Hang on, I'll get us a cab. Playlists. Chat, that's an automatic copyright. What am I thinking? No, I'm not going to play any music right now. Automatic copyright. Completely just demonetize the entire fucking video. Chad, should I just stay up all night? At this point, I'm not even fucking tired, dude. I'm gonna just stay up all night. And just beat the entire game. Wants to see me. And then I'm gonna wake up in the morning and stream again. You know why? Because no matter what in life, whether it's... Let's say you used to be into bodybuilding. Let's say you used to be into fitness and stuff, right? You have to have a certain mentality to do that, right? You have to continue to be consistent and work hard and believe in yourself and believe in the process. That's a big part of it, right? Believing in the process, believing in yourself, and not just thinking that everything's a dream. You know what I'm saying? That it's all just fairy tale land. A lot of people in life would never have made it if they thought that way, if they had that mentality. So for you to judge another man for having a mentality of he's confident in himself is just stupid because you have idols in your life, right? You looked up to certain people, if they didn't have the mentality they had, they wouldn't be your idols. So save that for your son, please. Save that for your loser fucking son. You say so. Man. Because with a dad like you, so not, no one's specific, by the way, but I'm saying if you have kids and you're going to, if you're going to give them the same, the same, the, the same shit that you say to other people, if you, if, if you told your kids the same thing, he'll be a fucking loser when he grows up. That's what's going to happen. Get that made somewhere. I want to give it to Akane-san. Uh, you know, provided she'll accept it. So that was it, huh? Don't try to bring me down with you. Maybe. For what it's worth, I thought it might make the boss happy. So, what do you think, boss? I'm not. I'm. I'm not ending the stream until we go, till, till we get to Hawaii. Okay. Until I swim in that water. Until I can surf. I don't even know if you can surf in the game. But until we get to Hawaii, I'm not ending stream. I promise. Nice our bat pack. <laughs> All right, let's go. Head to the taxi stand near the station. What's up, Nancy? That's my pet crawfish, of course. Nancy. I sort of bargained for her life with a homeless fisherman. She's been with me since. Namba stuck her in a clay pot as a joke, but turns out she finds it pretty cozy. Oh, yeah. If I'm going to Hawaii, Nancy will need a sitter. 
wonder who I could ask. Uh, Adachi san, maybe? Huh? That a no? Listen, if my stay in Hawaii goes long, you might dry out by the time I'm back. Just come with me! Hop in the backpack! Wanna see Hawaii, huh? Sorry you can't come. Yes, you're coming. Fine, have it your way. We're in this together. You wanna come to Hawaii with me? Let's go! <laughs> Woo! Yeah, yeah. Be a good girl, keep cool, Nancy. Imagine telling her sorry you can't come. I'm good. Why is that even an option not to bring the crawfish? All right, let's go. Time to go to Hawaii. Chat, there's at least one dumb blonde bitch out there who does not know that Hawaii is part of America. <laughs> ah! Jeez. Why is he air humping? Uh, just another crazy off the streets. <laughs> Whatever. We know how to. Roger. Oh yeah, this guy deserves to get his ass beat. Let's do it. He does he miss. Cool. <gasps> you wanna fight? Break yourself. Crush you. <laughs> yeah. Pigeon raid. Watch this. Hope this hurts. <laughs> Okay. Have fun with this. Oh! Ah! He used his ass! He used his ass! To f he bat that thing up on me. Oh no. I'm not juvenile, bro. We got another one in the back. Man, what was his problem? I swear, this city's just as ugly as it ever was. Oh, ho! Oh, a turncoat titillator. Classic. You've not lost a step, Kasuga. How fortunate for us all. Uh huh? It's been a while, my boy. Harry Potter? You! Uh, who were you again? <laughs> It's me, you fool, Professor Morikasa. Did I just push him? My bad. Oh, right. I was just kidding. Of course, I remember you, Sensei. Sujimon Sensei. This guy a friend of yours, Kasuga? Uh, you were with me when I met him. I think he took us over to his um, Sujimon Center, right? Come on, man. It's hard enough to remember the names of cute curls these days. Much less scarred up cue balls. Uh, if you say so. Uh, listen then, this guy's the Sujimon Sensei, the creep who researches other creeps. Let me fill up a whole catalog of data on them. The Sujimon. <laughs> Guilty as charged. More monster than man all. Sujimon! Uh huh. Okay, yes. It's a stretch for the necessary classification. For society to rid itself of these violent creepers, research and categorization are vital endeavors, you see. As ever, my own no shit in this world. Despite all my efforts, it's still rotten with criminals and degenerates. Just look around you for proof. And so I collect data on them. They're That's why you needed Kasuga's help? Since he's always getting his ass kicked in the seediest parts of town? Right! It's coming back to me now. Well, Kasuga? Huh? Uh, sure. You do still have the Sujidex installed on your phone, of course. Don't you? Hey, hold on! You... You deleted my Sujidex app! All that data... Gone! Hey, man, those things don't have much space. There's no cloud backup. Nothing. I 
It's an app that records data about dangerous figures inhabiting. <clears throat> inhabited. Bro, I'm having a hard time pronouncing this word, and you guys think I'm fucking stupid now. I know how to say the word, dude. Okay? They're inhabiting in the city. They're inhabiting. 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 Inhabiting in the city known as Sujiman. Study up on their weaknesses. Oh, what a pain in the ass. Enough whining. You want to keep the world safe, don't you? Wait, I forgot. I'm planning to go to Hawaii soon. Will this thing even work overseas? Huh? Well, it should, in theory. But why are you headed there, might I ask? I've got some stuff to take care of. My oh, boy. Hawaii is known far and wide as a Sujimon paradise. Huh? Really? Mmm. One could call it an entirely different region of Sujimon. A tropical dreamscape, yet a land of shadows, blessed by the sun and the moon. In fact, I've even heard tell of some sort of Sujimon tournament there. Uh, how would that even work? Perhaps. We'll speak more of that when the time comes. Away now, my boy. To Hawaii you go for priceless Sujiman data. Remember, gotta dispatch them all. Become the Sujiman master again. Whatever you say, Sensei. If there's one more cutscene before I'm. This might be my one chance to get it all back. I knew it. I knew I couldn't trust him, man. I knew it. Dude, what is up with the posters on the wall, though? Wait a minute. Is Japan, like, just known for women, like, being sold as sex slaves or what, dude? The Rose Blossom? A Rose Blossom Club? I'm okay, I guess. Chad, I paid seventy dollars for this game. Is that bad? Hmm? What's up? Hmm? And I paid like seventy dollars for Rise of the Ronin. Is that bad? I don't have time to fight. I'm trying to go to Hawaii, dude. Let's get a beef bowl before we go. This might be the only time... Chat, we're about to go to Hawaii. This is probably going to be the last time we get to have an actual... Authentic beef bowl in Japan. Let's go. Ordering foods at restaurants will recover HP and MP, as well as deepen your bonds. With your active party members. Combo meals? It can trigger table talk. Ooh. Okay. Why do I want to jump through the stream? I want to jump through the stream right now and go eat it. Hold up. That looks really good. Let's get the regular beef bowl for old time's sake. Do I have to order for them too or are they gonna pay for themselves, dude? I'm not gonna buy I'm not gonna buy for everybody. Well, I'm starving. I'm real meal. That's that is great. Thank you. 
Chad, if you go to mm, Chad, Chad, it, mm, Chad, if you go to dinner with like three men, should you should each guy pay for themselves? Is there ever a case where a guy should pay for another guy's food? Ever? Let's go. Finally, the big moment. Hey, Ichiban. You sure you got enough stuff with you? I mean, it's Hawaii. Not a day trip up to some hot spring. You stay in there at least a few nights, right? Bring enough change of clothes? Hey, if I run out, I'll buy some. I hate dragging luggage around. Look at us. First we're homeless, and now we're stressing about extra clothes. Hey, you're right. You really moved on up. This might just be the R&R &R you needed. Take the time to enjoy it. Oh, and I'm good with any gift. But macadamia nuts. Sure. Thanks, guys. Well, guess I'm off. Happy travels. Wow. I think I'm gonna cry, chat. <laughs> Arachi and Nanma left the party. That was so fucking cringy what I just did right there. Why did I do that, dude? I wish I had a time machine right now. Sunrise in Hawaii. <sighs> My dick is hard right now. On behalf of all of our crew, thank you for choosing to fly with us today. We hope to see you again soon. She gave him birth on the plane? Oh, please, just, just wait. Oh, that's a guy. Oh, wait, now I feel fucked up. Hey. Mind if I take over? Yes, please. Thank you. No need to be so gentle with it. Just lift him by his belt here. Like a sumo in his loincloth. See? Man, respect to anybody out there who's handicapped, man. That's got to be a hard life, bro. I want to give my condolences and respect to anybody out there who's in a wheelchair watching right now. And I also want to give my respects to anybody who's just mentally handicapped who's watching right now, too. Because I bet you there's at least one person. Yeah, that would do it then. Anyway, you here on vacation? We could say that, yeah. YouTube, come to Twitch. Well, let's make the most. I'm not reading YouTube chat. I can't even see YouTube chat, but come to the Twitch chat. Oh, uh, Who what now? Uh, uh, It's like saying until next. I can only read Twitch chat. It's not showing YouTube chat. I don't have it on my my screen. YouTube, come come to Twitch. Why do I talk through the cutscene so much? Don't tell me I have to run everywhere here, too. Sure would be nice if the taxi driver spoke Japanese. Bro, you act like you haven't been speaking English the entire game. You haven't said one word of Japanese yet the entire game. Okay. Kasuga's money has been converted to USD. From this point on, any cash gain gained will be converted automatically when appropriate. The exchange rate is fixed at 100 yen to $1. So in other words, I shut up with five bucks. Find a driver who knows Japanese. 
I don't see the point, though. I can speak English perfectly fine, dude. Copyright. Hey. This guy definitely does not speak Japanese. I'm sorry, but he's brown. Is that Japanese? What's it say? Never mind. Shouldn't be that hard to get around, right? Sure would be nice if the taxi... Okay, we already read that. Bro, are these all Indian guys? Ah, you can understand me, okay. Can you read this? Here's hoping they know enough to hold a conversation. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, my Japanese really no good. Dang, can't read it, huh? Too difficult. Maybe try Thanks. another taxi? Bro, the only thing Japanese he knows is the porno! I'm done. Bro speaks sign language in Japanese. This has to be him. Arab? I thought he got kidnapped. What's he doing in the game? Aloha. Aloha. Uh this mean anything to you? Chat, can you guys hear this? Hmm? Oh, do I speak Japanese? Oh, you can read it! <laughs> you just come in from Japan? I got you. Now, uh, hop in. Hey, all right! Oh yeah, I don't trust him. Where to? Here's the address. Look familiar? Hmm, uh... That's a good ways away. Oh, really? Is it gonna be a long drive? First time in Hawaii? <sighs> yeah. Cool. Welcome to the island. Uh, hope you have a nice time. Okay, he's definitely an industry plant. Nah, somebody, somebody's setting me up right now. Hey, so... You're from Japan, right? I'd love to get out there one of these days. <laughs> you say that to everyone who flies in from Japan? Like this is a sales pitch? Nah, that's how I really feel. Japan's a wonderful country. It's super peaceful. It's a great food. Yeah, but what about Hawaii? This place is supposed to be heaven on earth, right? Well, the warm weather all year round is nice. Chat, if but, I uh, ever go to Hawaii... Yeah, Hawaii's got its problems, too. Ugh. <sighs> Before I die, I have to go to Hawaii and lay butt naked in the sand, dude. I seriously like. Oh, they make great custom. I have to do that at some point, dude. Get a lot more before. Just to feel the sand on every part of my body. This time around's kind of personal. You know, you're a pretty upbeat guy, huh? Is that an islander thing? <laughs> no, I, I get that a lot. That I'm easy going, but I'm not all Hawaii. My dad was from Japan. Oh, really? Then is your mom from here? Yep. Huh. Hey, I guess you're the same as me. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Actually, I only found that out just recently. No way. So, would I be Hawaiian or would I be an islander? How's that work? Uh, hey, uh, sorry, but mind if I see that envelope again? I, I want to check the address. Oh, sure. <sighs> Just 
Something's not right here. Something feels off. We almost there? I could have sworn it was more toward the suburbs when I looked it up. Oh. Is that right? Because somebody did their homework. Bro, start punching him in the face right now. Never trust a smile. I'm never going to trust somebody who's smiling again now. I don't trust anybody. I'll never ride an Uber. Yep. Never again. I'm never riding an Uber. That guy seems so nice, too. See, this is why I love the Japanese. Butter them up just a little, and they'll trust almost anyone. Should I be putting my hands up? Eh, you can stay as is, long as you're quiet. I'll want your wallet and your smartphone. Bro, you do not know who you're fucking with, man. Don't you? You're gonna shoot me? You? Really? You bet your ass. I'll call your bluff. I don't think you can. Uh, uh huh? A lot of people say America's some gun crazy cowboy country. But I doubt many of those cowboys know what it really means to pull the trigger. Let's go. The, the hell's your point? Let's go. Hey! Just walk up and put it in your mouth like this. Oh! You want to know if someone's going to shoot you? Look at their eyes. A little practice, and you'll get the hang of it. Ah! Hey! Didn't think you're <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what was that back. though? No. For real? Why did it just cut to that picture? God damn it! Don't get smart with me, asshole. He just what? No Let's do it. Crooked cabby, bro. He just walked up to you and took the gun out of your hands, and you're trying to fight him right now. No wonder he has a big old wrench. Cool. What the fuck? Break yourself. Get lost. Battery shock and block. Cool. Ow. Yeah. I push the button, man. Hero's wisdom. What's this do? Dude, I had to. F I better make this quick. Last chance. Last chance. And fuck. yes. That was a close one. We made it. Cash four dollars. You know, if it just did your job, you'd have got a fat tip. But now all you get is a fat lip. Oh, and give me my envelope. And you're about to get a fat dick. The one with the address, man. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bro, it was self-defense. You gonna turn yourself in? <laughs> Actually, it's uh, you I'm turning in. Huh? Yo! That's a Kane Sons! What the hell is wrong with you? Spit it out! <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, you taxi robbing dick. The fuck? 
Officer, help! I am being robbed! This hooter wore my money and he pointed a gun right at me! Wait a sec! Don't tell me you're seriously buying this crap! Are you? All right, all right, smart guy. Put your hands in the air and turn around! Okay, hang on. I, I'm doing it. Get on your knees. Right now! I can explain. I swear I just got into town. I haven't robbed anyone. Come on, uh, arrest that scumbag. I'm pissing myself over here. Damn it. Why me? This is bullshit. <laughs> Better luck next time, asshole. Hold on, officers. That man is no thief. Oh, hey, you're the Ahuijo guy. Who you should be arresting is the driver. He's I'm so kid. satisfied, dude. Proof? I recorded the whole thing. Here. Yes! Hey, oh my hey. god, man. Hey, you saved my ass. Not even here a day and I almost land myself in jail. Sorry you had to go through all that. I was surprised myself. Thank yeah, God for cameras. Well, actually, I was following you. Following me? <sighs> That's right. Please tell me he gets to be a part of my 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 my, my crew. Please tell me that he's a part of my crew and we can fight together. Looked suspicious. You could tell just by looking at it. And the thing is, I was born here. As it stands, I've got a bit of um, a sixth sense for it. I can tell if a driver's out to scam tourists or not. And he was setting off the alarm, huh? It's not like I was a hundred percent certain about him. But you were so nice to me on the plane, and I imagined what might happen to you, and frankly, I just couldn't leave it alone. Well, thanks, man. You really saved the day. Oh, I'm Kasuga, by the way. Ichiban Kaku. Kasuga-san? My name's Mitamura. Eiji Mitamura. Hey, that's a good name. So, Kasuga-san, where were you headed, if I may ask? I... Oh, shit, that's right! The address was on the envelope! The envelope? Was that what that driver ate all of a sudden? Yeah. I wouldn't know the address without Did it. Did you copy the address somewhere? No. I didn't think I'd lose something that important. I see. Actually, hold on a moment. I might have something. Huh? You know what? I might be able to work with this. What? Are you serious? I can see the envelope in the video I just took. It's too rough to read as is, but I can try tweaking the footage. And then we can read it? Yes. Cool, let's go back to your place and I'll sit on your lap. You'd really do that for me? Of course. In fact, I'd say this was meant to be, but I won't need my laptop to enhance the video, so... If it's no trouble, can I ask you to come to where I'm staying? Oh, sure! Why well, owe you big time, eh, John? Eh, John? You're agey, right? So you're eh, John. Sorry, did, did I get a little too chummy? Oh, no. It's just been a while since anyone gave me a nickname. Anyway. What do they used to call you? Crazy legs? Let me chill, dude. What the going? fuck did I just say? Actually, Kasuga-san, aren't you hungry? Uh, oh, yeah. I haven't eaten anything since I got here. YouTube, I cannot read any chat. If you guys want to chat, come to Twitch. In that case, why don't we do that? I haven't had anything either. I can only read Twitch chat. All right. First big Hawaiian meal. Let's do it. There's a place I used to go to pretty often. We can go there if you'd like. Uh, is there he just threw up the Kawabunga sign? Nah, I'm game for anything. People tell me I act like it's the best thing I've ever tasted, no matter what I'm eating, so... <laughs> well, that's good to know. Yeah, if you're picking the place, then I'm ready to chow down. Just 
Maybe we keep it cheap, because, you know, I'm kind of broke. Oh, no worries. It's a casual little place. <laughs> We're in business then. Welcome to America. Oh, man. Going on a trip's great. You meet all kinds of new people. Shame about the first guy waving a gun in my face, though. Could have done without that. I hear you. Still, all in all, that kind of thing doesn't happen too often. Honestly, I wonder if he's all right. Chad, does everybody throw this up in Hawaii or what? You're worried about him? A guy like that? Well, I mean, the guy didn't seem... Yo, they are so built. You're one of a kind, cousin. Another guy. Not everyone could admit something like that. Especially about someone who tried to rob you. You don't think? <laughs> Maybe it's the island. The bigger the space, the bigger the heart, you know? He better not throw up the sign. Chad, should I stay up all night? Chad, should I stream all night? If one person subscribes, I'll stay What's up the all night. What you think of when you hear Hawaiian food? Oh, let's see. Loco Moco, I think? Oh, I know I've heard that one before. I mean, hamburger patties and sunny side up egg on rice? I'd wolf that down in two seconds. Oh, <laughs> it is tasty. And these days... They better have beef bowls hamburger. here. You can get it with chicken or even mahi mahi. Mahi mahi? Oh, it's a type of white fish. The big ones get up to about six feet or so. Chad, I can't even lie. Hawaiian time slaps. Y'all ever had Hawaiian time, the restaurant? Oh my god, that goes so hard. Good story. On that note, Kazuga san, how long are you planning to stay in Hawaii? I don't know. I haven't decided, but. I doubt I'll be here for the chicken, long. the macaroni I'm salad, exactly the white sure rice. Oh, then what for? Work or something? No, it's not for work. Oh, yeah? Well, we've come this far. Oh, my God. I love the soundtrack so much. My mom and I were separated at birth. I'm telling them my life story now. Apparently, she's still alive. She lives out here now. I came out here to see her. You're in a wheelchair. We separated? And that I is fine. Really Sometimes life is rough, is but is you'll be fine. Wait, wheelchair that, bound that boy. Anyone? Was that hers? Exactly. You I'm are still great you in your own through. way. <laughs> you know, one door closes, another opens. I mean, you're everything is going to be okay. Wheelchair bound boy. Okay you. Yeah. You've been a great friend so far. Asuka san. <clears throat> All right. I guess I'd better get you that address then. I can't let my new pal down. After all. Yeah. Best friends. I better be able to live with him too. Let's live together. Let's build bunk beds. I get the you get the bottom, I'll get the top. Only because your legs Thanks. don't work. These graphics are beautiful. Check out that view. All I usually get is some nasty sewage canal, so this is really something. That's right. Oh, right. You said you were born over here. You visiting your family? Yeah. yeah, you might say that. Always good to keep in touch. See, another thing is I have trust issues now. After the taxi driver, I don't know if I can trust anybody, bro. How do I know I can trust him? What if he's setting me up, too? Mm. I, honestly, if mm, he better be he mm, he better be handicapped. I'm sorry to say this, but you better not be able to use your legs, bro. If you end up being able to use your legs, if you are not actually wheelchair bound, I'm gonna break those fucking legs. That way, you are wheelchair bound. Let me chill. <gasps> Why would I say that? No, I'm gonna get canceled. 
I'm a freelance engineer. I, I used to work full time corporate, but it was a little awkward to stick around once I got in the chair. I see. That's sad, bro. Man, respect to anybody out there wheelchair about in a wheelchair, bro. That's gotta be a tough life, man, but at least you're still alive, right? Huh? At least you can still stroke. Let me chill. Huh? At least you still have your hands. Yeah. Bro, mm -hmm. let, let, just let me explore Hawaii, <laughs> please. Okay. Just let me explore Hawaii. The wind blew my scarf into the ocean. It's really special to me. Hmm. First side mission? Her scarf was blown into the ocean. She says it was really... Bro, she just told me that. You don't have to come and... Leave it to me. Oh, wait. I guess she had to translate. Or he had to translate. Oh! So the whole time, he is speaking Japanese. Oh, it's only in English because I chose the English option. I thought that he knew English this whole time. But no, he actually only speaks Japanese. That's why he can't talk... Now it made sense, bro. Honestly, okay. Yeah, now it made sense. My bad. I thought he could speak English this whole time, but he can't. <laughs> sure. I'm never eating it again. I'm starting a diet today. I'm starting a low-carb diet right now. Dude, imagine walking around looking like this, dude. Look at look at his physique. Look at how look, look at the shape, dude. Look at his V taper. Oh my god, man. I want to go on a low carb diet right now, dude. Can you imagine how you must feel walking around like this? Let's spit some game. Excuse me. Pardon me, miss. Uh, I couldn't help to notice that uh, you look a little cold. You mind if I uh, hug you right now? Fuck, man. I suck at Riz, bro. What did I even just say, dude? We can swim. Okay. Dive. Dirty can. Garbage dumps into the ocean. <sighs> Faded pink book. This better not be a... <sighs> <laughs> Let's go. So it was a gift from her late husband. Glad we got it back for her. Excuse me? Jumping into the ocean just like that? What were you even thinking? <laughs> Bro, I'm sorry, but I actually have legs. I can swim. Appreciate you playing Navigator. Goodness, I haven't yelled like that in a while. Sorry for the wait. Now we can go. <laughs> What's going to happen when we get in a street fight? Please tell me he can fight. Hmm? Back in Japan, I'll often snag a permission. A permission. A persimmon off one of the trees in the park. Is that a no-go out here? Mm. 
I'm not sure. I've never even thought to do that. Plus, I don't have legs, so I can't jump up there and grab one off the fucking tree, dumbass. I doubt they put you in jail for it, though. Oh, seriously? Good to know. Huh? What does he want? A, a coconut? That's just a guess, though. Wait, what are you doing? What do you mean? I'm grabbing some fruit. Huh? Pardon? I saw it on this one anime when I was a kid. It just looks so good. <laughs> I always wanted to try it. Sure, but isn't it better if you get it yourself? Bro, just go to a coconut bar, dude. <sighs> just go to the bar, dude. They'll put alcohol in a coconut for you. <laughs> totally. Wow. Sup? No. Your throat's all dried out from the yelling earlier, right? Quench it up! Huh? How did you know that? I heard that cough a mile away. Sure. Chat, we're going live tomorrow morning too. I'm probably just gonna stay up for another, I don't know how long, we'll see how long and then, cause it's midnight, it's 12.10 where I'm at right now, it's past midnight. I'm either thinking about staying up late or I'm just gonna wake up early and stream too. So, sub up right now so that you guys can be alerted. We're trying to beat this game and beat Rise of the Ronin before we play Dragon's Dogma 2. I never thought I'd get one straight from a tree like this. I can't remember the last time I did something so childish. Plus, Chad, I also want to play Red Dead Redemption 1 on stream before Kai Sinat hops on it like a fucking dick and starts uh, playing that too before GTA 6 comes out so that way he can actually, you know, act like he's playing Rockstar games even though he has not been playing them his entire life. He just is hopping on the bandwagon. Maybe I'm just being a hater though. Because in fact, I'm doing the same thing technically. Well, moderation ski, I suppose. Anyhow, we should get going. It'll be dark before long. Wait a minute, it gets dark in Hawaii? I thought the sun stays out all the time. Wow. Hmm? Hmm. What's up over there? Oh, that? They're probably just trying to pick her up. They tend to go after the tourists around here. Well, that's not unheard of. She looks kind of upset, though, huh? Yep, I'd certainly nice say so. Figured as much. I thought maybe it might be a different overseas, but nope. Can we get away with fighting here in America, though? That's the thing. In Japan, it's a different story, but here in America? I'm gonna catch an assault charge. Nah, but if it's self-defense and if you're, if you're defending a woman, then it's not assault. I said no. Come on, baby. You don't gotta be scared. Come with us. It'll be fun. It's kind of thick, but it ain't gonna hurt that bad. Hello there. Uh, pardon me. The fuck you want? Hmm. Ah, shoot. What's the word? Oh, duh. Lady. She is troubled. Not good, okay? What? The hell is this guy on about? I forgot I can't speak English chat. This is crazy right now. Shit, maybe maybe their English sucks too. The lady, she is troubled. No good? Hey, piss off. Or what? You want to get your face oh. smashed? Now this I understand. Body language. Let's go. Come on, please tell me, please tell me that he can fight. Now you're just being reckless. Things might get a little rowdy, so don't get too close. Normally I wouldn't, but I'm not about to leave you hanging. At least let me offer support. Seriously? Well, all right, pal. <laughs> I'm not doubting him, bro. He still got them hands. He may not got legs, but he got them hands. This guy thinks he's hot shit, huh? Let's splatter him. 
Let's see. Let's see about that. Low lives? What? He's he's my hype man? Ah! Ah! Let's take him out. Bro brought a knife to the fight? How are you going to talk all that smack and then bring a knife? That's what you get. I swear to God, I'm pushing the button, chat. I'm pushing the fucking button, dude. This could be it. Let's rock. I'll show you. Kasuga-san, allow me. Let's go. Bro, get him some pom poms. Let's go. My bad. Sorry, man. We learned our lesson. Honest. They said they learned their lesson. I see. I'll bet. So did I master English yet or what? You mastered sign language. Sorry about all that. You're safe now. Now in Japan, we ask for a kiss on the cheek if we save a damsel in distress. Thank you for saving me. Ah, uh, you're so handsome. Damn. Wait a minute. Maybe let me say thanks. My hotel's just down the street, huh? What? What do you mean? My hotel's just down the street? No way, dude. Come on, I promise it'll be fun. Mm. Oh, I, uh, hey, I helped out too, you know. Sorry, guess I was more her type. No way that a guy in a wheelchair just pulled bef- I haven't been laid in over a year, bro. <sighs> she clearly just doesn't appreciate a more rugged older man like myself. Dude, there's no way that this guy in the wheelchair just got some ass. Does it even work? Yeah, excuse me. This isn't fair, dude. I've been waiting my chance for so long. Bro, wait a minute. All girls in America are sluts. That girl was a whore. She just invited him back to her hotel to smash. Sure thing. Dude, why did I just say that? Oh my god, bro. Why did I just say that? That was horrible. Oh my god. Why would I say that, dude? That was too much, man. That was way too... That was too much, man. Aloha. I'm sorry about that, Chad. That was too much. I'm just saying, who in in real life is that really gonna happen? If if you actually save it, if you beat up three guys, are you gonna get invited back to some chit's hotel? Welcome. Unfortunately, our coffee machines undergoing maintenance, but our sandwiches are still available. Four dollars for a sandwich, of course. Real inflated prices. Real American prices, bro. Man, this is comedy. This is comedy, bro. I'm going back to Japan. 
Thank you. Hey. Here you go, pal. Thank you. Man, Hawaii's awesome. It's gorgeous everywhere you look. I'm glad you're enjoying it. If I wasn't stuck in this chair, I'd show you a few other places too. Chat, seriously though, can guys in wheelchairs smash? Like, does it work? I really want to know now, because... No, this has been great. Have you been in there a long time, h -on? No. I'm going to look that up real quick. Uh, I was Hold in up. an accident after work one day. I guess it's been about four or five years since. Can guys yeah, in wheel chairs yeah, I suppose. Uh, have you mentioned him earlier. sex? Oh, yeah. Unfortunately, an historically, society oh, has desexualized wheelchairs users I met him when I was and kid. others with disabilities. But the town. truth is, people with disabilities have the same sexual needs as anyone else. Wow. Losing the ability to move body parts does not mean that the need for sex and intimacy is also I lost. I to be the legs he never had. Still, that wasn't what he wanted at all. Really wish I would have known that sooner. Kasuga-san? Okay, oh, so sorry. they still- but that doesn't answer my question. All that the internet said was that they still have libidos, that they're still horny. They still get horny as fuck, but can their dick get hard? That's what I want to know. Oh my god, why would I say that, bro? I'm gonna lose viewers. Talking to myself. I'm sorry, chat. He's a dear friend to you, isn't he? Yeah, he is. He's more like a brother, if anything. Let me chill, dude. Let me chill. Well, that's how one of us sees it, at least. Oh, also, am I going the right way here? Oh, yeah. This way's fine. All right. Chat, I might end stream at the three hour mark and just wake up early and stream. Kasuga san, if I had to guess, I'd say you have a lot of friends. There's something about you. And you're incredibly easy to talk to as well. Hey, thanks, h -son. I'll introduce you one day. Maybe once we're back in Japan. Oh, no. I would just get in the way. Nonsense. We got nothing better to do. So, you and your friends, you said you're all in Yokohama? Yeah, Ijincho. I ended up there after getting shot this one time. Woke up in a garbage can. A buddy of mine who was homeless at the time wound up saving my life. <laughs> you're making things up now, right? It's the truth. Honestly, I've never told a single lie in my life. <laughs> you sure that wasn't a lie? <laughs> See, look, you're on my chest. You still got the bullet wound. You're kidding. Oh, wow. Is that really a bullet wound? Yeah, and the guy who saved me is a good friend. Has been to this day. He did eventually find work and stuff, but as I said, we're all back on the job hunt now. Yeah, that's right. Sheesh, it's all coming back to me. Everything was my fault. I'm why they lost their jobs. Is everything okay, Kasuga-san? Yeah, sorry. Uh, just some baggage I haven't let go of. Well... I don't know any of the specifics, but if they're your friends, I'm sure they've gotten over it. <laughs> you sure know how to cheer a guy up, eh, Sean? Uh, <laughs> don't mention it. How slow can you push a wheelchair, dude? Here we are, Kasuga-san. He's staying in the Motel 6? Oh, we're here? Okay. If He's staying at the Holiday Inn? How's it look, h -on? Can you pull it off? Well, I'm gonna run the image through analysis right now. We'll know soon enough. Unreal. I'm totally clueless with this stuff. Well, I could never fight off some lunatic cab driver. Okay, analysis complete. As for the address... Huh, I think we got it. Holy crap! How did you do that? 
Hey, I'm just glad I could help. You're the man! Thanks so much, Achan! <laughs> hey, it's you! From the taxi! <sighs> it's like a meat locker in here. So, these were the ones giving you grief, Tomizawa. Uh, yeah, th there's no doubt about it, my son <laughs> Dude looks like a modern-day pirate. Hmm. You know, your face looks awful familiar. That's right. Yeah? Now where have I seen you before? Oh, that's right. Your Kasuga, the hero of Yokohama. Huh. I'll be darned. Don't tell me you boys don't know. Kasuga here starred in the great dissolution of the Yakuza. What? I take it you didn't come for an autograph. Your little taxi scheme went south, and now you want to settle the score, is that it? While it is true that Tomizawa here botched the job all by himself, the car he got impounded belongs to my syndicate. Oh yeah? You trying to tell me there are Yakuza in Hawaii? <sighs> Not exactly something you'd find in a guide. There's so many cutscenes, bro. <laughs> On that note, someone's going to need to reimburse us. At a glance, I'd say you're strapped for cash. You do seem rather lively, though. I have so three hundred dollars. And I'm in Hawaii, the no most expensive the state in America. What I do know is you've got it ass backwards. If anybody's gonna reimburse you, it should be him. I do see your logic. The problem is, he's worthless. Yes. <laughs> oh, does somebody not drink his milk? A light tap like that and your bones go crunch. Fragile little thing. How could you? I'm glad, bro. He deserved that. I don't even feel bad a single bit at all. Money, you know. And so, I gave him work because he... The little cocky fuck! Income. So if anything, he should be thanking me. Hmm. Hmm. That's some fine-looking tech you got there. Don't you goddamn dare. If you want to fight, you got one. But leave Achan out of this. Kasuga-san, all that's left of your envelope is on there. I didn't think to back up that image. What's he gonna do, break his legs? Got it. But don't worry. I won't let him anywhere near you. Let's get it. It seems we're at an impasse then. Let's blow, chat. Oh, I'm freezing my ass off in here. Freezing? Why were you not sweating your ass off? If only that were the case. He's cold-blooded. He's a reptile. Tropical weather does nothing for me. Nobody understands. However, this might warm the blood. Let's go. Kasuga-san, let me take support here. Thanks, Aton. Kasuga-san, by all means. Pinpoints an enemy's weakness. Let's go. Well, let's go. Let's 
I'll show you. Hazuka-san, you're what? <laughs> Dude, I'm pushing the button, man. Now, are you all right? Here, cool. Woo! Let's go. Chat, would you just believe me if I told you I could clap without using my hands? Oh, Fuck. Why'd I say that? No. Let's play. You take off your clothes first. You okay, Ajon? I'm fine, but I'll need time to recover. He struggles to restart the PC. Okay. Dude, really? Now, Kasuka-san, allow me. Let's get it done. I have to block the next attack. Let's go. Break yourself. Bro, it might be John Wick. Hold up. Wait a minute. Isn't John Wick actually half Japanese too? Is a crazy thing. Keanu Reeves. Isn't he half Japanese? Let's pump it up. The game, not, not, uh, not, 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 not a penis pump. Let me chill. Sorry, H son. No telling if there's more on the way. We gotta go. Kill that guy before you leave. Run him over with the wheelchair. Run his head over. And the image of the address is secure. I just sent it to your smartphone. Really? Okay, it's getting intense now. Jeez, you're in this scary mess because of me. You got guts, eh, Sean? Not at all. I just didn't have much of a choice. <laughs> when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Thanks, eh, Sean? I mean it. You're my hero.
Yo, Mike TV vlog. Appreciate the view. Ichiban Kasuga, eh?